<laughs> just no matter how good my PC is, no matter how many games I play, consistently that Ubisoft logo is ultra laggy. Did they did they try and render that out in like 3D, or is it literally just like an old video clip? And they're like, you know what? We don't have time to rebuild this. Just ship it out like that every time. <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, hello everybody. I'm in the Littlewood, also known as Martin, and welcome to a Havagander at Grow Home. So this is a game that I got a code for at the end of January, and I know that's a long time between then and now, but I wanted to save this game for the brand new schedule and be the first Havagander because this game just looks like a lot of fun. I really just like open world games. I love a bit of parkour and climbing and stuff like that. And not only that, but the music is so good. I just love how trippy and bitty it is. And also the visuals as well. It really gave me a big kickback to Cube World. Looked really vibrant, very obviously sort of like polygon based. And uh, let's just jump into this. So I'm playing this with the Xbox controller for Windows and the controls are pretty minimal. You literally have left trigger, right trigger and the two sticks to obviously move the camera and move yourself. And it's day 937. Okay. Life sustaining ecosystem discovered. Scanning for star, star plant. Right, okay. Oh my god. Star plant located. Oh, amazing. Okay. Jobs are good in. And this is who we play as, the botanical something or other. It went past too fast. Let's pretend he is the botanical unknowing daredevil. <laughs> That's what I'm going to call him. There he is. Good old Budweiser himself. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Good Lord, Bud. All right, he's up and about. He's moving. What the bloody hell is going on? Internal power low. Well, let me stand on this very suspicious looking teleporter. Uh, mom, okay, activate additional teleporters to travel by Wi-Fi. What? We can travel by Wi-Fi in the future. Oh, yes, okay. How do I activate it? Oh, that's one arm. That's another arm. Do I move the arms? Uh, kind of. It looks like I move the arms in the direction that I'm facing. To the window! To the wall! To the wall! All right, let's get going. Why is he moving so slowly? There you go. Pick up some momentum, bud. Don't fall over yourself. Oh, a point of interest. What is that? Oh, it looks like some kind of crystal. A bud compatible fuel source. Collect crystals to upgrade. Sure. There you go. Let me pick up that crystal. Whoa! Oh, Jesus. All right. Okay. <laughs> uh, jump with A. Hey, look at that. Oh, this is great. All right. Okay. So let's do this. And then if I just keep doing that. Oh, look at bud. Go. Go, buddy. Go, buddy. Go. Go, buddy. And he's straight up. Oh, this sick game is very cool. I'm already one over. This is amazing. Oh, oh, don't fall backwards. Oh, God, buddy. You almost went off the edge. I know you're excited about having the crystal, but Jesus. Uh, can I pick up that really weird looking plant? What are you? There you go. Yeah, I'm going to pull you out the ground and then just lob you off the edge. Oh, but not myself. Not myself, buddy. Hold on. Oh, God, he held on. All right, that thing didn't break. It just sort of continued as it was. I like that the arms automatically extend upwards, you know, to go to the, the higher parts. All right, let's keep climbing up this thing. There you go. Can I go like sideways when I climb? Oh, I can. Oh, this is very cool. I like this. All right, up you get. So it looks like there are a couple of random islands that are like floating around in the sky. I'm not entirely sure how we're supposed to get to those. Crumbs. This place is remarkable. Examine the wildlife carefully and grow that star plant. Right, so that big thing over there with the elephant trunk is the star plant. How the hell do I grow it though? Oh God, what's this? Oh Jesus, what's going to happen when I grab this? It's a fall flower. What a feathery, potentially floaty flower form. All right, okay, all right, all right. So if I grab you and then just run off the edge, does that mean I can... Oh, no, wait, hold on. You can get a parachute. I thought it would be a case if you pull it out and then it, like, spins as you descend to the earth. So do I just... I just jump now. All right, let's go for it. Oh, yeah, look at this. This is very cool. Okay, well, I'm going to use it to go inside that little volcano that's over there. Oh, God, but it looks like the leaves are falling off. Oh, come on. No, no, stay petals. Stay petals. Stay the course. Stay the course. I think it might just make it. Yes. Oh, yeah. Awesome stuff. And you can press Y to take it off again. And it seems like I can pull it back out whenever I want to. So I actually get to use it for its length of petals. It's not just a case of once you touch the floor, it's gone. It's actually the petal count that's important. Oh, this is very nice, isn't it? All right. Well, I think we... Oh, no, there is a crystal in here. Okay. I was about to say, bud, I think we just wasted a lot of time. So I do wonder how much there is to this game. Because, I mean, this game is currently on early access on Steam. Oh, there you go. I got another crystal. So I do wonder what the kind of the length and the depth of this game is. Unless this is more of like a tech demo for a future game to come. All right. I'm just going to run up this mountain like Wolverine. Look at the speed. 
All right, maybe if I make the strokes a little longer. That's what she said. Uh, <laughs> I'll get there quicker. Whoa, you did, Ethel. You don't have a, a little squirrel suit. You only have a little petal left. All right, now how do I grab you? Do I just pull you? Yeah, there you go. Yank you out the wall. Oh, yeah, this is awesome. All right, we've got 4% of the crystals. What? Are there literally 100 crystals here? Oh, God, I have no idea. Right, let's get up a little bit higher here. So how would I get to that massive floating island that's above the star plant? There's something really glowing up there. I think that might actually be the sun. Or is it? No, something's like properly strobing up there. Oh, I want to find out what it is. Oh, God, and that island's like an entire crystal with just like a bit of earth over the top of it. Oh, my God. Can I move boulders? I reckon I can. I reckon I can. There you go. Let go. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Does it have water splashes? Let's see. Uh, no. <laughs> it has the tiniest little splash. That would have been way more of a splash in real life. There you go. There's another crystal. We're at 5%. Uh, where are we going to next? Ah, there's another one of those uh, respawn stations. I'm just going to float down there. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> but that, was the, that wasn't the least bit graceful. All right. Teleporter. So do I just grab you or what? How do I use you? Don't hu that hu bird, don't hump the teleporter. <laughs> bird, stop humping the teleporter. <laughs> stop it. No, give it a rest. Give it a rest. Oh, the controls are there. All right, good. Yeah, that's it. Less humping, more jumping. Oh, and it's off. Oh, Jesus. So does that mean now when I jump into this, I can go back to the last one? Let's see. Oh, God, look at that map. Oh, that's very cool, isn't it? So how do I control the map? So it's left stick to navigate. Well, currently, that doesn't actually move the map at all. So I guess if I just press A, or X even, let's see where it takes me to. I reckon this will probably take me back to the start, won't it? Let's have a look. Yeah, look, there we go. We're back at the start. So I assume once we have numerous teleporting spots, that the left stick will actually be of some use. But at the moment, it's just one way. Is that a house up there? No, I think that might just be a really tall tree. I'm not sure. We're going to find out what everything is on this island. Right, so how do I reload this? So if I press Y at the minute, do I have just the one? Okay, now if I grab you, will that give me a fresh one? Let's have a look. Ah, it does. Fantastic. Oh, no, but one of the petals fell off straight away. Oh, God, that's not good. All right, so I've already lost the petal. Hold on a minute. Oh, bud. Oh, bud. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God, this is like 127 hours. You know James Franco. You know James Franco. Go on, climb out. If only it was this easy for him in the movie. Oh, God. Hey, oh, oh, no, no. Come on, bud. He's a bit of a klutz, isn't he? Jesus. Can I jump? Oh, I can jump whilst grabbing onto things. Okay. That changes everything. So instead of jumping into the mountain this time, let's grab that crystal that I spotted over there. Oh, God, you pick up momentum really quickly. Did you see that? I did like a double step, and he just like took off. All right, let's grab this crystal. Oh, do I need two hands to grab that one? Come here, you bugger. Oh, out the ground you get. All right, that's 6%. I have no idea what the thing across the top means, but I'm assuming we'll find out soon. Uh, oh, wait, are they sheep? <laughs> are they little polygon sheep? <laughs> Look at the way they run. Look at those back legs. Oh, they're great. And he walked into a cactus. Can I grab the sheep? Right. Now, definitely don't hump this. Definitely don't hump this or you'll be an English stereotype. All right. Now, where are we taking you to? Shall we take you to the teleporter? <laughs> let's, let's throw the sheep through the teleporter. Let's see what happens. Here we go. You will go and meet mom. There you go. Does he do anything? No, he doesn't do anything. I have balls to it. Never mind. Oh, no, he's stuck in it. He's genuinely stuck in it. <laughs> All right. Look at his eyes. He's like, huh? Oh, uh, Lucy? L Lucy, this guy kind of took me and I don't know where I'm going. Is it shearing him? It almost looked like it was shearing him then. <laughs> but that's just the particles from the teleporter itself. Oh, man, I love this game. This is totally the kind of game that you could live stream, isn't it? I'm not sure how engaging it would be to be like a full-on Let's Play, but... Ugh, I could be proven wrong very easily. Uh, where are we going to? There's another crystal over there, actually. I want to get to 10% and see what happens. I want something really miraculous to happen. Hello, Lucy. All right, double hand grab and let go of it. There you go. Oh, I can do like a double grab to climb up. Ah, that works. Right, now, shall I climb this life tree or this star tree or whatever it's called? It was called like a star plant, wasn't it? I do wonder what's at the end of it. Yeah, that's very suspicious, that little like trunk and stem that's hanging out. Whoa, steady on. Am I supposed to pull this off? What are you doing? <laughs> He's like flagpoling. Oh my God. You're going to be a free runner in no time, my friend. Oh wait, you should be able to guide shoots towards the energy rock. <gasps> oh my God, so I'm going to like knock down 
the uh, the thing. Oh, Jesus. I don't think I've done that right. <laughs> Grab the shoot and hold tight with X. All right, okay. Oh, God. It's growing. Oh, that's... You just got penetrated, my friend. You just got penetrated. Anybody walking by in the corridor outside my office is going to be like, uh, what's, what's he playing in there? Is he even playing anything? Is he on live Jasmine again? Is that what's going on? If you're under the age of 18, don't type in that URL. It's not going to end well for you. You're going to get grounded. Uh, we got loads of petals here. But I don't think a great deal else happened. I mean, it looks like I can continue to climb up this star plant and get all the way upstairs. I do hear a proper jingling and a jangling, though. Are there any crystals around the side of me? Ah, there is. There's one right there. Hold on. No, bud. Okay. Bud's pretty resilient. Don't worry about him. He's, he's fine. With all these little sound effects, I'm definitely getting a bit of a Wally vibe off of this guy. I absolutely love it. All right. Come on, bud. You got this. No, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> he did a double arm reach. That was like a Superman fail. That was great. All right, let's try again, bud. Oh, yeah, that time you nailed it. Stuck the landing. 10 out of 10. Sorry, Russian athletes. You got nothing on this guy. All right, where's that crystal at? It was kind of like on the underside and around. Oh, there are mushrooms up there. Hello. I can't help but feel like we've missed out on a few crystals as well. There you go. Pulled that one out. All right, that's nine. We're nearly at that 10% mark that we were looking for. Let's have a look around. Are there any more crystals in our peripheral? There's a very... Is that in the ocean or is that floating? There's a very... I'm going to go over and have a look. There's a very suspicious looking rock over there. And I don't like it. This is exactly the reason why the other day I said I would definitely opt for the umbrella from the uh, the new movie, The Kingsman, rather than a Mary Poppins uh, style umbrella. I mean, it'd be great to fly with one, but it'd be bloody terrifying. The only thing stopping you from hitting the ground is your one grip, your one hand on that umbrella. I would not trust myself. I don't have that kind of strength and stamina. So yeah, these rocks are just legit just floating here. None of them really seem to have any crystals on them. They're just... They're just there. Oh, oh, what the bloody hell was that? <laughs> wait, did I just get launched? Hold on, let me jump on you. Are you bouncy? Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. I want to find out what the hell you just did. You definitely just did something. Maybe that was just a weird physics glitch. Yeah, it looks like it might have been. All right, never mind. Anyway, should we continue up this plant? Let's get ourselves up there. I want to find out what the crack is. <laughs> that sheep is going to be stuck there forever. I love that he kind of looks at us as well as we go by. He's like... Uh, any time now. Any time now, that'd be great. Lucy, Lucy, come here. Lucy, don't destroy the plant life. All right, come here, you're grounded. I'm taking you to your room. I'm like pulling her by her ear. Oh, no, I'm not. Oh, no, I'm not. She's escaped. Oh, if you don't come back, you're going to be grounded for two weeks. Come on, bud, grab her. Grab her. Oh, bud, why are you so slow? It's a joke. Oh, she fell over. <laughs> Barrel roll, sheep. Great. All right, let me walk backwards then. There you go. Oh, that looks... That looks wrong, doesn't it? All right. Let me try with just one hand. Come with me. There you are. Freed up some space. All right, you're coming with me straight to the principal's office. And apparently I'm now getting really strong. She's not even getting to hold up a fight. Whoa! Bud, what is this? You're like a serious street performer. Look at this sort of dancing. You're like those guys that can twist their arms behind their heads. And apparently now your entire torso... Oh, God. That can't be good for you. Let's just jump a lot. There you go. All right. In you get you. You're going in and all. There you go. I'm going to leave you in there. <laughs> Lucy and Trevor are both tucked away in there. Are they going to push each other out? Or are they infinitely stuck there? <laughs> this is brilliant. I'm so easily sidetracked in these open world games. But I think that's kind of the point. I think the idea is you're not just supposed to go hard on the objective. you just got to sort of wander about and make up your own stories and make your own paths. That almost sounded deep for a second there. I love games like this. I just love games where it's a pleasure to traverse things, like climbing over things, running and jumping, stuff like that. As the more fluid it is and the more simple it is, like, I just, I can't get enough of those kinds of games. All right, but don't fall off. Grab onto the thing and then press X. All right, here we go. Where the, oh, oh God. We've released the Kraken. <laughs> We're riding the dragon, everybody. <laughs> where the bloody hell are we going? All right, sure. We've twisted and turned around a little bit there. And Pierce. There you go. Star plant is what? A hundred and... So wait, is the star plant just a separate thing that's higher up or what? I can't quite work it out. Oh, God. The bud, bud, don't fall. Don't fall. God, I thought it was going to fall there. I'm still struggling to decide if the star plant is something we're trying to get to or if it's something that we are just clambering across. There you go. Look at that. And we're up. And there are loads of crystals up here and a giant orange. <laughs> and a giant orange. Come on. Up you get. 
Nope, it's stronger than I am. I don't possess the strength as Bud to pick up this orange. Let me try again. Oh, no, I forgot. All right, fine. When in doubt, just barge into it. It's like, oh, you don't want to come with me? Fine. Ugh, not him. It's quite violent, buddies. Oh, right stick to zoom in and out. Oh, hello. Can I go into first person or... Oh, I see. When I get to different percentages of the crystals, it unlocks different abilities. So I unlocked the jump in the beginning. I've now got the camera zoom in. Oh, and I'm only going to get more as we go on. Oh, this is very cool. I feel like this is just going to be like a start to finish full playthrough <laughs> in just like a singular video. Ah, there's another one of our teleporters over there. Should we go for it? I reckon we can reach that. I think we're skipping a few steps there, but it would be great to be able to teleport back up to it. Let's do it. Oh, for mum. Where's Y? Oh, God, there's Y. Okay, we got it. I can do it, mum. Look, I'm doing it. I'm going to get over to that teleporter, I hope. Oh, God, she loves me. She loves me not. Oh, mum loves me. She loves me not. She loves me. Yeah. Good job, bud. All right, activate the teleporter. No humping it. That's it. Bring all the legs down. <laughs> the little Lego legs. There you go. And one more. Or is that the actual control panel, this one? Let's have a look. Come down, you. Oh, there you are. Ah, so it wasn't the control panel after all. You just pull all three of those down and then you're done. That's the first time I've actually, like, properly done that. So I've probably just fallen over the other two. <laughs> so that's fine. Uh, where are we off to next? Uh, I don't know why I'm trying this, but apparently I am. No, that just failed. Altitude loss critical. Oh, I'm on the shore again. But at least I got that teleporter before I actually, uh, before I left. So it means now that I can just get straight back up there. Oh, yeah. All right, come on, bud. He's not even having to grab onto anything. Let's see how quickly we can get him to move. He moves pretty fast, doesn't he? Or it's more so he descends quickly. The gravity seems pretty harsh on this planet. <laughs> How's it going, Lucy and Trev? Let me in. Let me enjoy this party. There you go. All right, let's teleport to number three. Are they going to come with? I hope so. I really hope so. Are they going to join us? Oh, they didn't join us. Bugger. Never mind. That's fine. All right, so there's a couple of crystals over there. I'm pretty certain I've skipped. Oh, whoa, whoa. Jesus. Why does he do that? Sometimes he pulls on them. And then he just, like, can't control his own strength, and he just ends up flying off. Oh, my God. But yeah, like I was saying, I think we've missed a couple of these spiky things. So let's go and grab the next one up. There you go. Actually, I'm not even sure it's the next one up. There might well be another one between the one we've just used and this one. But either way, let's press X and see what happens. Oh, here we go. Ba -ba 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 -ba. What? Left stick to guide. Oh. Oh, I get to choose. Oh, now this is a specialty. Here we go. Go on, keep going, keep going, keep going. This place is well out of reach. Is this the first time we've been able to control this thing, or have we always been able to do that? All right, now be careful here, bud, because we're in a little bit of a tight spot. That's it, get climbing. Up you go. Bit of a jump. Ah, there's a crystal right there. Grab it. Yeah, look at that, 12%. We've got our next ability at 20, so we've got about eight more crystals to grab. All right, don't worry about the orange. I know he hurt your pride last time, but you're bigger than him. You can be the bigger man. You can be the bigger bot and walk away. Oh, Jesus. Uh, I do think that maybe there's going to be crystals on these undersides. I'm just going to have a little little climb around and see what's there. I don't know if they would be that harsh about it. Nah, everything looks good to me. All right, let's get ourselves back up. We don't really have a fast travel back to the, uh, the teleporter, so I reckon for now we might just try and run back across... The huge thing that we just created. There you go. Uh, what does the leaf want? What are you talking about? Extremely elastic! Oh, no, I've fallen. Oh, God. Maybe I can land back on it. <laughs> I didn't even get to read what the thing said. And there's another one just beneath us there as well. All right, there you go. Grab on. There you go, good lad. All right, before you try and get to a leaf, let's try and not die here. Good. All right, now, will I be able to make this? <laughs> oh, 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 God. Oh, God. There you go, bud. All right, you got it. You got it. All right, where are we off to? Let's have a look. Uh, oh, God, I mean, wow, there's like an entire kingdom up there. What is that? Oh, man, I wonder if there's like a max distance you can travel with this. If not, I am going up to that waterfall right the way in the top. Oh, it seems to have stopped. Oh, no. And that's it. I've, I've gone and buggered it now, haven't I? Rubbish. All right, let me drop down onto there. Let's find out what this thing reads. Oh, no, grab on. Whew. Extremely elastic, new growth, interesting. Ah, I never saw that crystal over there. My bad. Let me go and quickly grab that after I grab the leaf. There you go. You got it. Good lad. All right, come on, bud. 
Oh, oh, Jesus. Yeah, okay. He does get a little bit funny around those spiky things, doesn't he? All right, that's 13%. Seven more to go. So I think I'm going to make my way up to the Mega Island. And like I said before, I was looking for all of those little crystals. It looks like they are on the underside of this mammoth one. So let's get climbing. Oh, oh, Jesus. <laughs> were, you trying to, uh, were you trying to kiss your own booty hole there, bud? What's going on? <laughs> well, you know, it's 30 things you got to do before you're 30. Apparently, bud talks like that as well. I just imagine him as being like a massive drinker. I think the only time I've ever seen similar glitches to that is when like I'm playing like Oculus games and VR stuff. Grab the red flower on a star shoot and connect it to an energy rock. All right, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So are you telling me there's one that I've not done yet? Oh yeah, I see actually, yeah, there's one down there. Let's grab this thing and hook it up to the energy crystal. Here we go. I need some like Benny Hill style music for whenever this thing grows out. There you go. Oh, something's happening. The star plant is now 214 meters tall. I think. What fierce growth. Marvellous. And it makes more red plants grow. Okay. So there is a benefit to using all of these. So it means that those ones that I've wasted before uh, might hinder us in the long run. Ah, there. yeah, I don't think we have actually been to this island before because there is a crystal right there. So I'm going to grab you and then I'm going to jump off and go and grab that one that we saw down by the ocean. Here you go. Oh, come on. You can do it. I believe in you. Oh, come on, bud. Come on, bud. You've been lifting. You can do this. Ooh, there you are. Fourteen percent. We get a new ability in six more crystals. Was it that way? I believe it was. Oh my God! Play Zoe Bad. We free falling right now. Oh, look at that. That was a perfect dive. Oh man, Tom Daly. Oh balls. Are we dead? I was about to say Tom Daly would be proud, but. Apparently not. <laughs> this time, I won't allow myself to die like that. So I'll press it at the last second. Boom, there you go. Nice soft landing. We'll let go of it so we keep a lot of our petals. There you are, look at that. Perfect. I want to find out at least what this third ability is, and then I can wrap the video up there for today. This is definitely the kind of game that I'm going to be live streaming uh, when the streams come back. Ah, I missed the crystal in here as well. I bet there are tons that I've missed in places that I've already been to. Uh, now, how are we going to reach you? We're a little bit... Above me. <laughs> there you go. Got it. All right. 16%. Uh, oh, there's another one there as well. Good Lord. There's like three of them inside of here. There you go. 17. Where's another one? Come on. There's got to be more in here. They do tend to make like crystalline noises, don't they? You know what sound I mean. Physical crystals don't make sounds, but they always have that kind of like navvy twinkle about them. Oh, God. Oh, God. Don't drown. Okay. I don't think he can swim. That's, the, that's why I died last time. Yeah. Let me get into the water. Yeah, he can't swim. Okay, that makes sense. It's nice to have some restrictions. Uh, I guess really I should be using the teleport, shouldn't I? That saved me a lot of time. Whoa! Boom! Hit the ground. Has that dried up? I could have sworn there was water there before where that uh, where that grass is. <laughs> Trevor. Trevor and Lucy are never going to break free there, are they? Never mind. All right, up to number three. League stats. This game has a proper, like, Jack and the Beanstalk vibe about it, doesn't it? I really, really like it. It's all I'm thinking of, though, is not the actual story itself, but more so, like, the telling of it in the uh, TV show Once Upon a Time. And even that one random Sabrina episode. Does anybody remember that? Sabrina the Teenage Witch, where they ended up going all the way up it and facing the giant. Oh, my God. We're actually way closer to the, uh, the waterfall than I thought we were. It's not actually that far out of our reach. I think the red mushroom is our next goal. And I think those glowing red things, I'm fairly certain now that they are just the teleporters, so they're a good thing to try and follow and move in that general direction. All right, now, bud, grab onto that, but don't... There you go, don't fall off. Sweet. All right, two more, and we'll get our third ability. Uh, there's one, actually, over yonder. Hello, buddy old pal. You're a lot bigger than the ones in Minecraft, aren't you? Bloody hell. Uh, are you just decorative? It almost seems that way. Let me jump on you. Oh, God, hopefully not over you. Uh, you do wiggle quite a bit as well. <laughs> What's going on? Do you do anything? No, I think you're just a dud, aren't you? All right, yeah, you're just a dud. All right, should we keep on going upwards? All right, shimmy around the edge. Ooh, hello. There's, there's some kind of little inhabitant inside of there. The geology of this planet is rather remarkable, and I just got an achievement called Where's Warble? Is that Warble in there? Hello, Warble. Nice to meet you. I'm Bud. How's it going? <laughs> Look, he doesn't even say anything. Can I Can I pet you? Hello. All right, Wobble, you're coming with me. Nope, he doesn't want to go anywhere. What's your deal, Wobble? What's, your, what's the crack? Oh, there you go. Oh, God, no, don't strangle the bird, Bud. Jesus Christ. 
I think they've already gone extinct once. There are a lot of crystal noises inside of here. What is that? Oh my god, does that propel me upwards? Let's find out. Come on, I want to find out what this does. I can't seem to land inside of it. There you go, come on. There you are. No, nothing? It seems to almost like go into freefall mode when I'm over the top of it. Let's try again. Let's grab whatever this is. Uh, it does have some kind of... Whoa, yeah, look at that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, you just kind of like float over it. Interesting. I reckon that'll be a mechanic that I'll introduce in the future then. But then that one's not over any of those weird crystals. There's some seriously strange stuff going on in here. Whoa, hold on a second. Can I guide this thing? Oh, that'd be cool if I could. Oh, I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> I love it though. There's no explanation. It just kind of happens. Things occur. It's fascinating. There you go. Pull you out the wall. Oh, have I not got you? Whoa, there you go. The rocket pack. Oh, yes. Ooh. Engage while jumping. Oh, that is useful. That is really freaking cool. And I'm going with the currents. Oh, dear. Oh, man. I got myself a jetpack. This is sweet. I'm taking this. Oh, no, bud. Bud, try the jetpack. Try the jetpack. No, the jetpack didn't help much. So the jetpack doesn't keep you upright. The jetpack is more so... Oh, no, it does keep you upright. I was just at a terrible angle. <laughs> well, there we go. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. I'm very tempted, actually, to do another video on this. Maybe on Thursday, I'll do it as, like, a two-part Havaganda. Let me know if you want to see that. If not, I will most certainly be live-streaming this game until I basically complete it. This is totally my cup of tea. Like, I will definitely uh, try and get all the Steam Chiefs in this if I don't die first. Oh, God. Okay, we're good, bud. All right, anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Let me know if you want to pick up this game. There'll be a link to the store page uh, on Steam in the description. And I will see you all in a little bit. Bye-bye.